गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन लेट्स स्टार्ट टाइप ऑफ रिएक्शन एज वी नो दैट देर आर मेनी टाइप्स ऑफ रिएक्शन इन योर सिलेबस देर आर दे आर फाइव टाइप ऑफ रिएक्शन कॉम्बिनेशन रिएक्शन डिकम्पोजिशन रिएक्शन डिसप्लेसमेंट रिएक्शन डबल डिसप्लेसमेंट रिएक्शन विच इज ऑल्सो नोन एज डबल डिकम्पोजिशन रिएक्शन एंड रिडॉक्स रिएक्शन ओके लेट्स स्टार्ट कॉम्बिनेशन रिएक्शन In combination reaction, a chemical reaction in which two or more substances combine to form a single substance is called combination reaction. There are many examples of combination reaction. Let's just, let's start from reaction of non-metal with oxygen. Any non-metal when reacts with oxygen forms non-metal oxide. For example, C plus O two, CO two, S plus O two, SO two. फॉस्फोरस प्लस ऑक्सीजन फॉस्फोरस पेंटा ऑक्साइड हाइड्रोजन प्लस ऑक्सीजन वॉटर मेटल ऑल्सो रिएक्ट्स विथ ऑक्सीजन लाइक वाइज टू फॉर्म मेटालिक ऑक्साइड नॉन मेटल ऑक्साइड्स आर जनरली बेसिक इन नेचर दीज नॉन मेटल ऑक्साइड्स आर सॉरी एसिडिक इन नेचर एसिडिक इन नेचर एंड Water, as you know, is neutral. So, non-metal oxides are acidic in nature. Water is neutral, and metal oxides are basic in nature. Another example of combination reaction are calcium oxide plus water, calcium hydroxide. When you know chuna, quick line. calcium oxide is commonly called chuna that is quick lime quick lime when reacts with water it forms slag lime calcium hydroxide and it is very important reaction as it is used for white washing and another example is calcium oxide plus silicon oxide silicon oxide is uh, sand sand is silicon oxide when sand reacts with quick lime you know that it is chuna when it reacts with quick lime it forms calcium silicate there are there are some facts related to this topic like do you know what is quick lime and what happens when it reacts with water so quick lime is calcium oxide and when it combines with water it forms slag lime which is a chemical used for white washing after white washing it reacts with carbon dioxide to few days for few days and becomes calcium carbonate which is milky white in color so uh, when slag lime reacts with atmospheric carbon dioxide it forms calcium carbonate which is limestone and water so you must remember it is very very important that you must remember the three these three compounds quick lime calcium oxide when reacts with water it forms slag lime calcium hydroxide and when calcium hydroxide reacts with carbon dioxide it forms calcium carbonate okay now decomposition reaction decomposition reaction the decomposition reaction as you know the word decomposition so decomposition means to split to break to break the compound the in this reaction a compound split into two or more substances by heat light or electricity we can decompose a compound by action of heat or action of light or action of electricity so let's start action of heat thermal decomposition or thermolysis splitting of compound by heat this triangular shape delta is in used to indicate heat so let's start from calcium carbonate as you know decomposition of calcium carbonate breaks calcium carbonate into calcium oxide and carbon dioxide likewise magnesium carbonate the same group element calcium and magnesium are of same group element so their carbonates decomposes into their oxides and carbon dioxide but there is an exception exception 
that sodium carbonate potassium carbonate doesn't decompose by heating because their bond are very strong next is there are three major type of decomposition decomposition of carbonate decomposition of sulfate and decomposition of nitrate so let's see the decomposition of sulfate when ferrous sulfate is heated strong heating of ferrous sulfate decomposes ferrous sulfate into ferric oxide which is brown in color as you know rust and sulfur dioxide and sulfur trioxide the sulfur dioxide and sulfur trioxide both oxides are suffocating gases you must remember sometimes this is you know a question that uh, write a suffocating gas write the uh, formula or name of a suffocating gas so sulfur dioxide or sulfur trioxide both are suffocating gases next example is lead nitrate you know this reaction very well uh, a white compound lead nitrate when heated brown fumes of no2 nitrogen dioxide gases evolved and with the uh, with the liberation of oxygen also and formation of a yellow color lead oxide as you know in change in color example and the next example is it is very important to know the laboratory preparation of oxygen it is laboratory preparation of oxygen as potassium chlorate reacts uh, decomposes into potassium chloride and oxygen and you must go through the activities in of your ncert book 1.5 and 1.6 if any query you can question on whatsapp group and uh, after decomposition reaction the well, let's uh, decomposition of thermal thermolysis let's uh, start photolysis photolysis photo means light this indicates sunlight or appropriate frequency of light splitting of molecule or compound by sunlight is called photolysis for example silver chloride decomposes into silver and chlorine by the when it is exposed to sunlight likewise silver bromide when exposed to sunlight it forms silver and bromine and silver nitrate is if it is uh, exposed to sunlight it also forms silver nitrogen dioxide and oxygen now next uh, next uh, decomposition reaction is electrolysis splitting of molecule or compound by passing electric current the uh, simple example the important example of this is decomposition of water decomposition of water leads to decomposition of water by passing electric current leads to formation of hydrogen and oxygen this in this reaction two molecules of water decomposes into two molecules of hydrogen and one molecule of oxygen you must remember that why uh, uh, if the question is why two molecules of hydrogen is formed and one molecule of oxygen is formed so uh, then write this reaction and show that two moles by um, by balancing this reaction two moles of water decomposes into two mole of hydrogen and one mole of oxygen so two part of two part of hydrogen is formed in this reaction and only one part of oxygen is formed so this is an activity which is given in your book also but uh, see carefully these two are these two are carbon electrodes graphite electrodes which is present in pencil you can use two pencil electrodes here and set like set uh, apparatus like this fill it with water and two beakers two beakers or two test tubes here uh, there are two tape test tubes and add it by cathode and anode the negative part of the electrode is cathode and the positive part of the cathode uh, electrode is in anode 
because oxygen is more electronegative than hydrogen so oxygen ye an anode attracts oxygen and cathode attracts hydrogen opposite charge attract each other so hydrogen gas is collected over here and oxygen gas is collected over anode you must remember it which gas is liberated at which electrode anode at anode oxygen is liberated and at cathode hydrogen is liberated there are two parts of hydrogen two parts of hydrogen from here to here two parts of hydrogen is liberated here and only one part of oxygen is liberated because the reaction is two water molecule decomposes by passing electric current into two molecules of hydrogen and one molecule of oxygen you must take acidified water which is distilled water plus dilute sulfuric acid dilute sulfuric acid is used to dissociate water into ions because it is distilled water so no electricity can pass through it but if you add some uh, 10 ml of uh, h2so4 dilute sulfuric acid then it must dissociate and the re uh, reaction proceeded and forms hydrogen and oxygen another example is sodium chloride sodium chloride first melt it forms liquid uh, when li liquid sodium chloride decomposes by passing electricity into sodium and chlorine displacement reaction and double displacement reaction will be in another video in next class answer this question there are few question for your homework answer this question carefully